What's up guys, I'm Nico of Camp Crunch, and today I'm going to teach you guys how to do selective color with Adobe Lightroom. I'm sure there are a lot of other ways to do this, both within Lightroom and with other software, but this is how I personally do it and what's always worked for me, so that's what I'm going to teach you guys how to do today. And the picture that we're going to be working with is this portrait, and as you can see, the most dominant color in the portrait is blue coming from the camera as well as the shirt, so that is the color that we are going to isolate. And the way we do that in Lightroom is basically by desaturating all of the colors that we don't want in the picture. And you do that by going to the develop module, then you go down to the HSL panel, which is in the HSL color and black and white tab. So you open that and you go to the saturation. You can also edit them in the alt tab, which shows hue, saturation, and luminance. But for these kinds of pictures, I like working them on their own tabs. So we're going to go back to saturation. And again, we're basically going to desaturate all the colors that we don't want. So we're going to pull red down to negative 100, then orange, then yellow, then green, aqua, purple, magenta. So as you can see now, we've done it, and all we have now is blue. We have the blue. And if you want to reset it, all you have to do is click Option or Alt. And as you can see, the saturation turns into Reset Saturation, and you can click on that, and it will reset it. But again, we want the isolated color, so we're going to pull all of those back down. And you can change this even further by going to Hue, which changes the color. And we're going to go to the blue slider, and you can pull it two ways. You can pull it to the aqua side, or you can pull it to the purple side, which are the colors that are beside the blue slider. And I want it a little bit more purple, so I'm going to pull it that way. And then you can go to the luminance which basically changes how dark or light your color is. So uh, pulling it to negative 100 will make it dark and pulling it to plus 100 will make it really light. I want it a little bit lighter. So I'm going to pull it to around 19. That looks pretty good. And that's it guys, that's how I want my picture to be. Um, if you found this tutorial helpful, please like the video. If you want to uh, favorite the video, if you haven't yet, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, but if you want another video, if you have any suggestions for what my next tutorial should be, leave your suggestions down below and I'll make sure to, you know, do my best to make that happen. Peace.